I wish that there was more information out there about it that I didn't learn about it until after I had a child, you know, who needed services and then found out that it was through the Child and Family Connections. Before that, I had no idea that there was a Child and Family Connections and what services that they provided until I met with our service coordinator who, you know, gave us all the paperwork about it. We actually kind of kept everything private. We didn't let other people know that Imogen was in early intervention until actually about a year ago. Um, we decided to finally tell everybody that, you know, she was going through intervention, um, that she even had had strokes, because um, we didn't want others around her to treat her differently. So that was a big step for us to even tell people that she had early intervention services. Um, and then I started a nonprofit organization and kind of got the word out there, you know, and so now families who ask, I am a huge advocate for early intervention because I have Imogen to show that she has made huge strides just through the program itself and then, you know, them giving us the tools that we needed to help her at home. I think letting parents know that it's through Child and Family Connections and that it's not just an early intervention program, um, I think more parents would be receptive to it than, you know, because they hear intervention and that's a very scary word. We're very happy, you know, with with the care that we got from the early intervention program. It has gotten a lot easier for us to talk about, you know, our daughter having a stroke and how, how amazing she has done. And then also, um, you know, why she has done so well. And one of the big things for us is because of early intervention. Thank, Thank you, you, early, early intervention. intervention.